My name is Camille Leggett and I attend school at California State University of San Bernardino. I believe that the city of San Bernardino has so much potential, but it's essentially been drained of this potential because of, number one, the economic status of San Bernardino. One specific problem is the fact that there has been so much corruption going on within the system and within the political sphere of San Bernardino that it's trickled down and it's essentially hurt everyone um, in the midst and especially in the center of, of San Bernardino who live in San Bernardino and who have grown up in San Bernardino. Um, essentially, it, San Bernardino used to be a flourishing city that had a lot of businesses, a lot of economic status, but because of a lot of the businesses pulled out of San Bernardino, it has literally left this city that was once beautiful into a ghost town. Um, you could even go to downtown San Bernardino and literally walk down, just walking it, walking it from the bus stop, and you can feel the depression, you can feel the lack of love, the lack of care, just the lack in general in that city. Um, I didn't believe it until I personally took a bus drive down to San Bernardino, the downtown area, and I walked through there. There's a lot of poverty, there's a lot of pain. I am all in favor for a recall. I think that we need to get these uh, so-called political leaders, these political officials who s are supposed to take their job and better it for, the, for human beings, for the society, and specifically for San Bernardino. It's supposed to be for the people, and it's not for the people if the money is not going to the people, and if there are not if there are no programs or there are no solutions to solve some of the problems that are extremely evident in the city itself. If no one wants to adhere to it and that's their job, then you need to get out and you need to make officials and political leaders take that role who really want to help the city of San, San Bernardino flourish, who really want to help the people and who really want to see San Bernardino not have a negative stigma but have a positive stigma and, and at that they can help these people understand that you can rise from ashes and that's my belief in a society where a lot of minorities are placed in those categories. I believe that you can rise above all.